instructions to look and hunt for the mule leaders and kill them and maim them. In fact, nafamishwa kama ungeenda kamukunji nia ilikuwa upigwe risasi migu. Raila apigwe mizazi asiwawe alikuwa apigwe migu. Kalonzo akionekana migu. Kioni migu. Nia gani hii ilikuwa sasa what was the intention of one inspector general police kwa jina Kome ambaye we demand if he has a conscience hata sio kulazimisha na mtu kama ako na roho ya utu ajuzulu that is what they do in democracies na kuacha kazi because uwezi mwana Kome kusema ati azimio tunaenda kwa mochari na tunaenda tuna tuna, tuna rent mili huu mwili wa mtoto wetu ni kukomboa tumekomboa kweli Shetani ashindwe ama namna gani So mambo kama haya yanatuudhi sana yanawaudhi wazalendo wa Kenya hii lakini Kenyans are very resilient They know their rights under the law and they are going to pursue those rights Kazi ambayo ilianzishwa na ndugu haya governor Kivutha Kibwana when he was in civil society it got into our people watu wakajua haki zao za kikatiba so mimi naomba tu turuhusu kijana yetu alale lakini ile ile challenge ametuachia ni kwamba yeye angetaka dada yake akimaliza masomo go to deleza huyo kijana alikuwa ameapa kwamba akimaliza kusoma atakuja amjengee mama yake nyumba uh, mama mwendo huyu kijana ametimiza lengo lake amekujengea nyumba tumpigie huyu kijana makofi no mwaki yenye nyaka anda na mwaki eh hey, sisi zote tulifanya hiyo kazi mheshimiwa governor junior i thank you uh, kwa the contribution because ulipanda hapa one acre mwenye muuzaji hapa tunamshukuru sana akakubali kumuuzia kutukuuzia hiyo mama one acre na sisi tukachanga changa eh ile kazi kidogo imebakia junior i'm giving you charge let this not family want yule mtoto yule mtoto wako secondary school amalize na aende mpaka university asome zaidi Maana ndugu yake mdogo alikuwa anataka kwenda from uh, to Kenyatta University. Yeye yeah, aende even Nairobi University, <laughs> the Premier University, asome mpaka aje kuendelea na kujenga nji yetu hii. His her brother took the bullet, literally. Took the bullet on behalf of so many Kenyans and others who are perished. Today we are talking about 72 people already killed, failed by police brutality. Wengi zaidi wako bado mahospitali. Na wengine kama Mheshimiwa Muso wamekamatwa for nothing. <laughs> Wakapelekwa kotini. Eh, speaker wenu Mbilu alijificha hata nadhani bado anajificha. <laughs> Undola mtu amanze Mbilu aume hata kwa maondoe madhilile. <laughs> yaani kusumbua roho za watu. I think he's out of the country lakini vile alishtuliwa ajabu mbilo aliniambia waliomshika wakampeleka sijui wapi mashuru askari wenyewe alimwambia wanakauni tu au kwa tai ili tu inenyu hii ajabu hii so people know the truth and the truth is bado maisha ni magumu sana Kenya hii We hope they have started listening because I saw some newspaper headline because some of they are considering fuel subsidy. It is coming too late in the day. Because that's what we've been telling them. Kwa sasa no nende tawika my auntie kitinda mimba wa my late father. Na ni mambetele tembe wanagusi ikuru. Na huo kamba imonene ni Raila ikuma kibwezi kuziko ndikuita usweni hiyo ni dunia ingine ndio wakicheza hivi tutajitenga hata sisi si namna hiyo 
Do you know Kambane ni bigger than Rwanda? Inji nzima inaitwa Rwanda ke, Ukambane ni kubwa kushinda Rwanda. Kwa hivyo tumeona leo kwa magazeti vijana wa Kenya wakajitokeza waka apply waajiriwe katika idara ya utoshaji ushuru KRA and only two communities wakapata 58 point something Pana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Tupatie Yesu makofi mazuri. Mheshimiwa Jesse Kambalo has kindly agreed kunisaidia mpaka tukasindikize and nzisa huko Saikuru. Kwa hivyo mkiniruhusu atoe rambi rambi zake ndio sisi tuondoke na alafu nyinyi muendelee na shughuli. Ndugu Raila thank you for that understanding um, and, and the team. Asante sana. kwa familia ya mwendo